guys, it's Elizabeth. Welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to make a video on how to start a YouTube channel. So I started my channel about two years ago and the first year I wasn't really consistent but this last year I really have started to be consistent and so I've learned a few things along the way which I wanted to share with you. So if you're new to my channel, welcome. And if you are interested on starting your own YouTube channel, keep watching. I guess what I've learned to begin with is to be prepared. So that means to have the right equipment to film your video. With me, I just have my T5i and I have a microphone that I've attached to my camera and then I've invested in editing software and I use Final Cut Pro. So you can use anything. You can use your iPhone. I've filmed a lot of videos just on my simple iPhone and they've turned out great. Or you can use a point and shoot and I actually got this a while ago to start my vlogging channel which if you are not subscribed to that channel go ahead and check that channel out it is called her beauty vlogs I will leave the link in the description below but this is just a simple little camera and it has a flip up screen so you'll be able to see yourself as you're vlogging or doing whatever and a lot of youtubers do have the g7x but this was in my price budget so and it works just fine that's basically all you need to be prepared just simple pieces of equipment to start filming your video the next suggestion I have to start a YouTube channel is to be courageous have the courage to make your account. Make a channel name. My channel name is called Her Beauty is Inside Out and me and my friend a while back picked that name and I've just kept it ever since and it suits me just fine. But if you want to go with your say your first name and a middle name or something be creative in that respect. So that leads into the next suggestion is to be creative. Be creative with a channel name. Be creative with your channel art. Be creative when you do film and upload a video with the title and with your thumbnail. So when I make my thumbnails, I usually use the online program Pink Monkey and that works great and I'm able to be creative with that. Make your thumbnails bright and bold and eye-catching. And another part of making a YouTube channel is to be consistent. Have a regular schedule. So with me, I try to upload at least once a week. Sometimes if I have time, I'm able to upload more. But if you're able to make a schedule, let's say Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, be consistent and upload regularly on those given days, the more that you upload and are consistent, then people are more prone to see your videos and know that you're being consistent and will want to stay subscribed to you because they know they have something to look forward to. Another idea to start a YouTube channel is to be genuine. So if you get comments on a video, within that day or the next couple of days go ahead and reply to the, those comments that way your subscribers know that you're interactive and caring about what they're commenting on also if you have subscriptions and favorite youtubers that you like to watch go ahead and leave friendly comments on their videos as well and People who leave comments on their favorite videos or YouTubers, people will see the consistency of that and they might click on your channel and go, hey, I want to check her out. She seemed to leave a great, nice comment. Let's go see what she's all about. Also, I would steer you away from the sub for sub mentality. It is, first of all, it is 
considered spam and it will just go into your spam folder so if you say you know I'll subscribe if you subscribe to my channel I just highly recommend you not do that so when I'm watching my favorite youtubers I'll just if I like their video I'll just say great video or I love your makeup in this video or something like that regarding the video and whoever else is watching that video again will see that and go might want to click on your channel and that's a way to get more views and more subscribers to be kind and genuine and not just do it to gain something but have the mentality of to give something and regarding being genuine if you are starting a YouTube channel do it because you want to do it don't do it for the money don't do it because oh I want to be the next YouTube sensation most likely that is not going to happen so that leads me into the next suggestion on how to start a YouTube channel is to be patient like with me I've been on YouTube for about two to three years and again the first year I wasn't really consistent and I didn't take it seriously but this year I really am taking it seriously but again you have to be patient you're not gonna get a million subscribers in a night it takes time and consistency and persistence on your part so keep uploading don't lose the faith and last but not least just have fun with it I started my youtube channel just as a hobby to learn how to be a little bit more vocal how to articulate my words and my thoughts and to be creative so I hoped these little suggestions and ideas helped you out if you are in the process of wanting to start a YouTube channel it really is quite fun and like me if you're a shy person it will really get you out of your comfort zone and it gives you something to look forward to I've really gained a lot of knowledge through editing and how to film I hope you guys did enjoy this video give this video a thumbs up please subscribe to this channel and I will see you in my next video. Okay, bye.